Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Diamond's Groove. So in today's video, I'll be talking about how to move on after a breakup. How to move on after you've received your breakfast. It could be in the morning, in the afternoon, or the evening. So this video is basically all about how to move on after a breakup. We all know that breakups are not easy to move on. After we've been served breakfast, it's like taking something away from you when you had everything. It's just like taking some part of you away. It's really destabilizing. It doesn't give you that peace and comfort and makes you happy the way you should. Because at that point, you, should, you may be grieving or having a hard time moving on or having a hard time generally because of what has happened which is the breakfast you have the self breakfast i'll be talking about how to move on after i break up what you need to do how you need to chest it how you need to receive it and just move on because that's a face and we all will pass that face when we it happens to us when we go through such situations it will definitely pass away the other person you're thinking about or maybe grieving over might not even have you in mind might not even be grieving but you're already dying you're already thinking it's all over that you cannot start up again whatever the situation may be however it may have happened even though you were not at fault or you were at fault you still have to chest it and move on and enjoy life you could cry over it grieve over it that's fine but you just know that you have to move on from that particular face from that stage of your life just be able to move on or you just um, accept the fact that okay it has happened and it has happened and anyway they are just the truths how it should be so I'll be listing few ways few methods how we could move on after a breakup okay our first point here is that you have to remind yourself tell yourself you have to recall all the bad things that have happened if that could make you move on, that's what you need to do. First of all, remind yourself of all the negative things that happened. Don't even think of the nice things that happened. You know, just remind yourself of all the bad things, all the negative stuff that has happened. If that's the only way you know that you can use that as a means to like forget about the breakup, to move on from that breakup. Everything that connected you guys together, you have to... You know forget about it all the fun you had anything that could make you maybe think of oh or make you go back to that sober mood just forget it all what you need to do is to think about the bad things that have happened the bad things how you were stranded how this person made you feel how they did not treat you well just th think of any negative bad thing that happened in that relationship <laughs> just use that as a grounds use that as an excuse to move on all the bad traits, all the bad at attributes, attitude the person had, all the bad things you could think of that the person had done, you could just use that to move on. It makes you reduce that feeling of love that you have for the other person. It makes you not think about or even want to go back to that ex. It makes you move on. It makes you, it helps you to move on from that scenario. So all what you can think about at that moment is to think about all the negative things, think about all the bad things, think about anything, anything you guys share that were nice, just forget about it. Only the negative things you should think of if you have to move on from that relationship, if you have to move on after a breakup. Yes, if you have to move on after you've been served your breakfast. Because last last you reach everybody. So that's the only thing you can do right now. You have to, if it will help you, then that's fine. Another way you could move on after a breakup is for you not to stalk them on their social media accounts. Don't stalk your ex. Don't go to look at what they are doing on their status, on their stories, how they are vibing, or however they are feeling. That You shouldn't stalk them on their social media accounts, their social media app, be it their WhatsApp, their Facebook, their Instagram, their stories, their reels, whatever it may be. Don't stalk them. Just allow them be. It's even better to block them on all social media accounts. 
if that could help you move on that's the best thing to do because somehow they might be feeling down they might be feeling the breakup too you know as human beings but they don't want to like let you see that they have not moved on so the only way they could just camouflage and show you that they have moved on showing you things that will hurt you very well so you think that probably when they are in their alone time they might be grieving over the loss they also have you say ah, you guys are in a relationship now so they might also not want you to see that part so they'll not be putting their happy life how they are flexing with their friends meeting new people and all that while you you're staying in your own axis on your own end having grief crying over a spilled milk grieving for who is not grieving for you so they will just put out stuff online for you to see that they are happy without you and to get to you so what you need to do is to don't stop them don't stop them on their social media accounts if you know that will help you then you have to block them totally block them block them block them that's simple for your mental health for your peace of mind so you have to block them yes and you also if you don't want to block them you can also unfollow them just allow them be don't let them see that you're seeing their status because the more they notice that you are seeing their status they're going to be doing so many things to prepare you even though that person has moved on permanently there are some that may move on permanently and like okay it's over it's over and they move on very well that's fine so don't stop them on social media you have to like you have to unfollow them block them if that would be the best option for you another way to move on from your breakup is to have fun man this is the time you are single again single to stupor single as air single and free so this is the best time for you to dust your shoe if you had forgotten you had shoes or sneakers or whatever it may be or fine clothing this is the best time for you to go have fun of your life that finally you are free you can breathe have fun go out visit places see movies see friends you know meet new people as well if that will help you move on because this video is basically about how to move on after a breakup you have fun you see people you can visit your family see people that make you happy just visit friends that you haven't visited in a long while go on vacation if you need to go on a vacation you need to go do that for your mental health for your happiness for your peace of mind anyway if you've watched this video to this point so can you tell me why you haven't subscribed okay please subscribe to my channel and like this video give this video a thumbs up yeah and don't forget to comment in the comment section and um, share my videos okay guys so this other point is that you have to accept you've had a breakup another way to move on just as if you had a breakup give yourself a break a break from relationship give yourself a break to breathe in fresh air to just understand that this is a phase and this phase will definitely pass understand that whatever you're grieving whatever is making you feel that way it's okay to feel that way it's fine to feel that way that with time you're gonna move on you're going to be okay you're going to be happy again so this is a face understand that face don't be too hard on yourself don't cry out your eyes because your tears will not feel a river and just take it easy so give yourself a break appreciate yourself love yourself enjoy your company this is the time where you could just do your me time alone time and be happy see a lot of movies at home or the, at the movies just give yourself a break and be happy for wherever you are so guys we've come to the end of this video i hope you found this video interesting and one way or the other you learned one or two things how to move on after a breakup and don't forget you don't have to stalk your ex i think this one will help you move on after a breakup and guys if you watch this point thank you so much for watching my video please do well to subscribe to this channel turn on your post notification bell to get notified whenever i post new videos and comment share my videos and thank you so much for watching bye